Richardson. Good evening, teacher. <clears throat> Hello, good evening. Hello, Wendy, good evening. Hey, what's going on with the rest of the people? Is there something that's uh, new? ¿Cómo está el clima ahí por, por sus lugares donde, donde, donde viven? I hear right. Okay, Carlos. Hot. hot. Where is hot? Sí, es que estoy viendo que están reportando algunos lugares que, que está lloviendo. Entonces, pues yo... Pero no. No, verdad. <laughs> Okay, I have Julio Cesar. Hello, I have Fatima over here. And also Wendy and Carlos Josue. Let us wait a little bit for the rest, okay? Hopefully everybody uh, gathered tonight. Because, well, we have a lot of work to do tonight. Okay, now I have two, four, six participants, and well, we're going to start with the class, okay? Okay, welcome back. Can you listen to me clearly, Wendy? Yes. Okay, Julio Cesar, can you listen to me clearly tonight? Julio Cesar. What about you, Fatima? Okay, Luis got into the class. Okay, Luis, hello, Luis. Good evening. Hello. Hello, welcome, welcome back. Hello. Fatima, can you listen to me, Fatima? Uh, Carlos Josué. Hello, Carlos Josué. I'm here, teacher. Okay, pretty good. Hello, uh, Fatima. Well, Fatima sent a message. Okay, very good, Fatima. And ladies. Hello, ladies. Hello, teacher. Okay, good nice. Evening. Good evening. Now, I can see that we are more than ready to start with the, with the class, okay? So, well, yesterday we were talking about daily routines, right? You, you told me that you uh, got to work at a certain time, that you get up, that you wake up, that you uh, brush your teeth, that you iron your clothes, that you, well, a lot of activities, right? That we usually do during the week. During a day, I mean, daily activities, weekly activities, okay? So that's the way we, we do it. And... Also, I remember we were talking about a simple present and about the third person singular, right? Third person singular. Uh, we also discovered like, the, the rules to um, conjugate the verbs in third person singular. Okay, so that's what we did uh, yesterday. Tonight, well, we are going to continue. Well, you have homework assignments, right? ¿Cuáles fueron las tareas que tiene o cuáles son las tareas que tienen pendientes todavía? ¿Quién se recuerda? 
Ayer revisamos la, las actividades de su mejor amigo. Ok, todavía nos quedó pendiente el álbum para esta noche. Um, and, uh, I don't remember about what was the other homework assignment. Creo que también la, lo de la profession donde tenías que ponerle el número nada más. Ah, a, a, a Word document, right? Uh -huh, yes, okay. that's right. There is a, a document out there. Tonight, well, I I shared a, a file in WhatsApp so that you can download it and work with me. Por ahí les compartí un documento en, en WhatsApp para que lo puedan descargar, tenerlo ahí en su ordenador. Se los compartí en ambos formatos, PDF y Word, para que lo podamos trabajar. Que okay, eso lo vamos a trabajar en parejas. Pero ya, este, yo les voy a dar la indicación en, en su momento. Ok, now. Well, we're going to start by uh, introducing the topic with this exercise. Now, can, can you see the information? What are we going to go over tonight? We're going to go and describe daily routines, okay? Daily routines, okay? From Monday through Friday or through Sunday. Okay, we will listen to the audio. We're going to match the times with the actions using a draw and pop. Okay, like, like this, right? So we're gonna, you are going to tell me about the routines, okay, about the activities, okay, the person uh, does during cheating, so quick, relax at, at home, business meeting, work late, go out to clubs, visit parents, meet my friend Bill, and go to the gym. Okay, so as you can see, you have to pay special attention because we're going to start talking about uh, daily activities. Okay, daily activities. That's uh, that is the purpose for tonight. Okay, are you ready? More than ready. You may say more than ready, teacher. You ready, people? We're ready. Okay, are you uh, ready? Ready to start with, okay, just give me one second because I'm trying to arrange something here. Okay, now Monday, now we're gonna listen to it. Pay attention, please. First time, hey, it is only 20 seconds, as you can see, it's very short. Listen. It's a busy week. On Monday, I work late. On Tuesday afternoon, I meet my friend Bill. On Wednesday morning, I have a business meeting. On Thursday night, I relax at home. On Friday night, I go clubbing. On Saturday, I go to the gym. And on Sunday, I visit my parents. Okay, listen to it again, because we need to match. This week is a busy week. On Monday, I work late. On Tuesday afternoon, I meet my friend Bill. On Wednesday morning, I have a business meeting. On Thursday night, I relax at home. On Friday night, I go clubbing. On Saturday, I go to the gym. And on Sunday, I visit my parents. Okay, now did you listen to, to the lady? There are different activities. She says, this week, it's a really busy week. And for example, on Monday, work late. Work late. Go to the club. Go to the club. Listen to it. Monday. This week is a busy week. On Monday, I work late. Uh huh. Work late. Work late. Uh, work, work late. Work late. On Monday, I work late. On Tuesday afternoon, I meet my friend Bill. On Tuesday afternoon, meet my friend. Meet my friend Bill. 
Christmas. On Wednesday, Wednesday morning? On Wednesday morning. I have a business meeting. Business meeting. She has a business meeting. What about Thursday? On Thursday night, I relax at home. Relax at home. Relax at home. She, relax at home. she relaxes at home. On Friday night? On Friday night, I go clubbing. Uh -huh. go, 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 go out to clubs. She goes to she goes out to clubs. On Saturday? On Saturday, I go to the gym. Go I go to the gym. She goes, she goes to, go, to the gym, right? She, go. she goes to the gym. She goes to the gym. And on Sunday, I visit my parents. And on Sunday? She, she, she visits she parents. She visits, she visits parents. parents. Her parents. Okay, now. I will play it again. <laughs> yeah, I will play it again. And then you will tell me. Okay. You will tell me if, if you say it. Uh, on Monday, she works late. Work late. Work late. Okay. Works. Works, works late. Works late. Works. Okay, so that's I want you to I want you to put in, into practice what we started yesterday. What we started yesterday. Once again, pay attention. This week is a busy week. On Monday, I work late. Uh huh. What's go What's going on on Mondays? She's work late. Work late. She work, work late. late. She work late. She work or she, she works. Late. Work. She works. She works. She works. Yeah, that's that's why I'm doing this exercise because I want you to make emphasis in the third person singular. Oh. Next. On Tuesday afternoon, I meet my friend Bill. Uh huh. On Tuesday meet afternoon, my friend Bill. Yeah, she, but uh, uh, on Tuesday she, afternoon, she. Okay. She what? She my friend Bill. Okay, the verb is Bill. meet. Meet. Uh, she meets my friend ah, Bill. Now no, that's better, right? She meets my uh, my friend oh. Bill. Now <laughs> listen to what's what what happens on Wednesday. On Wednesday morning, I have a business meeting. Aha, uh -huh. on Wednesday morning. She she is in a meeting. Mm -hmm. I think I haven't uh, uh, we haven't um uh, have some practice about this verb. On Wednesday morning, she has business meeting. She has. She, we're, has, we're, has. she has business meeting. Business then meeting. On Thursday night. On Thursday night, I relax at home. Uh huh. She relax at home. R relax. Relaxes. Uh, relaxes. relaxes. On relaxes. Thursday night, she oh. relaxes at home. at home. Next one. Relaxes at the home. Yeah. On Friday night. On Friday night, I go clubbing. Uh huh. On Friday night, I she... go clubbing. She goes out to she goes out to clubs. She goes out to clubs. She goes out to clubs. Goes. And on Saturday? On Saturday, I go to the gym. And Saturday? She go to the gym. She go or she goes? Go to the gym. She, uh, goes. she goes to the gym. She goes to the gym. And on Sunday? Goes. I visit my parents. And what's what's going on on Sunday? She go to visit parents. Okay, she she she, she visit. Yeah, visits. it's it's very if you use only one verb. She visits visits parents. parents, parents. Okay, she visits parents. her parents. Okay. Parents. Yeah. So I will dictate. Le voy a dictar. Y ustedes lo digitan en el chat. Okay. Okay, number one. On Monday, she works late. On Monday, she works late. Okay. Yeah, Fatima, just give me one second, please. Le voy a compartir el enlace. Fatima lo está solicitando. Monday, she works late. Aha. Hola, okay, late. Okay, on Monday, okay, Fatima, pay Monday. attention. 
Now, everybody, this is very important. As you can see, as you can see, siempre que llegamos los días, siempre vamos a decir on Monday, on Tuesday, on Wednesday, okay? And something that I, that I want you to do is to uh, identify the capital letter of, it, of each day. Los días de la semana siempre se escriben con mayúscula. Okay, let me see. Okay, Elenison, you did. Okay, on Monday, she works late. Good. Okay, do me the favor to correct. On Monday, she works late. Okay, ladies. Okay, now let us let us go over the name. Okay, that's better. On Monday, she works late. Pretty good. No se les olvide el punto al final de la oración. On Tuesday afternoon, she meets her friend Bill. <laughs> On Tuesday afternoon, she meets her friend Bill. On Tuesday afternoon, she meets her friend Bill. She meets her friend Bill. Number three, let me see number two. On Tuesday afternoon, she meets her friend Bill. Pretty good, Fatima. That's the way it is. On Wednesday morning, on Wednesday morning, she has bis a business meeting. On Wednesday morning, she has a business meeting. Okay, Carlos, thank you. Thank you, ladies. That's the way it is. Okay, and number three, on Wednesday morning, on Wednesday morning, she has business meeting. Okay, thank you, Fatima. That is the way you should, you should do it. Okay, then we have on Thursday night, she relaxes at home. On Thursday night. Yo te uh, okay. On Thursday night, she relaxes at home. On Thursday night, she relaxes at home. Number five. Okay, ladies, very good. Number three, all right. Now, number four, on Thursday night, she relaxes at home. Then we have, uh, on Friday night, she goes out to clubs. On Friday night, she goes out to clubs. Number six. On Saturday, she goes to the gym. On Saturday, she goes to the gym. Do you listen to me clearly? Okay, on Thursday night, uh, okay, ladies, remember about relax, third person, relax. Remember about the verb relax. On Thursday night, she relaxes at home. Okay. 
Okay, on Saturday, on Saturday she goes to the gym, all right? Okay, lady, very good. And the last one, on Sunday, she visits her parents. On Sunday, she visits her parents. Okay, did you get it? Yeah, that's right, Wendy. That's the way it is. Uh, Luis, remember about the verb relax. In third person, is relaxes. Very good. Okay, on Friday night, she relaxes at home. Okay, so this is this is actually uh, an exercise to introduce uh, the topic for tonight. We will listen the last time, okay? And we are going to try to identify, okay, the activities once again. Work late, meet my friend Bill, business meeting, relax at home, go out to clubs, go to the gym, etc. Business parents, listen. This week is a busy week. On Monday, I work late. On Tuesday afternoon, I meet my friend Bill. On Wednesday morning, I have a business meeting. On Thursday night, I relax at home. On Friday night, I go clubbing. On Saturday, I go to the gym. And on Sunday, I visit my parents. All right, simple like that. And now we have one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Now, it's your turn. Ahora es su turno. De lunes a domingo. Escriban, por favor, alguna actividad muy relevante que ustedes hacen a diario. Okay? Now, how much time are you going to have now? Well, we have three, eh, five, seven. Seven minutes. Vamos a gastarnos siete minutos. Okay? Vamos a invertir esos siete minutos ahorita. Una actividad del día lunes, martes, miércoles, jueves, viernes, sábado y domingo. Y vamos a tratar de hacer algo similar a lo que ella dice aquí. Miren cuánto tiempo gasta ella. 20 seg segundos. We're going to listen to it last time. Algo así tiene que sonar eh, su pequeña presentación de 20 segundos. This week is a busy week. On Monday, I work late. On Tuesday afternoon, I meet my friend Bill. On Wednesday morning, I have a business meeting. On Thursday night, I relax at home. On Friday night, I go clubbing. On Saturday, I go to the gym. And on Sunday, I visit my parents. Okay, simple like that. Okay, you have exactly seven minutes. Siete minutos. Okay, everybody's going to participate, right? Todos van a participar. Solo son alrededor de 20, 25 segundos los que van a participar.
Y get concentrated. Cinco minutos. Okay, I will stop sharing this info. Okay, we're going to start. Uh, are you ready? Well, let's start with uh, Fatima. Okay, Fatima, what can you tell us? Okay. Okay, Jennifer. Let's see. I will give you like two minutes more. Let, let's invitamos dos minutos más. De modo que todos estén listos, okay? Listos y listas.
Okay, now yes, right? I think you have you had enough time. Well, let me see. Do me the favor to activate camera. Thank you, Jennifer. Thank you, Wendy. Activate cameras, people. We only well. Uh, well, I need volunteers. I mean, everybody's participating, right? An activity you do during the week. Okay, thank you, Wendy. Let us okay. listen to Wendy. Okay. On Monday, I prepare my breakfast. On Tuesday afternoon, I go to the cinema. On Thursday night, I study English. On Friday night, I go to the gym. On Wednesday morning, I wake up late. Uh, that's on, on Saturday, Saturday, right? Yes. <laughs> on Saturday, I visit my best friend. Okay. On Sunday, I go to the church. And on Sunday, you go to church. Okay, now let me see. Uh, Jennifer, what does Wendy do during the week? Monday, take the gear to a school. Uh, that, that's that's you, you. I mean that that those are your activities, right, Jennifer? Is yeah, that? yeah. Go ahead, go ahead. Monday, take take the gear to a school. Okay. Tuesday, I go to the gym. Wednesday, I oh. go for a room. Thursday, we go to the park with the family. Friday, we go to the movies with my friends. Saturday afternoon, I go, I go shopping. Sunday, I rest all a day. Okay. Now, remember, pretty good, Jennifer. That's really good. Remember that we say on Monday, on Tuesday, on Wednesday, Okay, but it was really nice. Okay, congrats, uh, Wendy and Jennifer. Now, what about you, Fatima? Are you ready? Yes, I'm ready. Okay. Okay. Um, on Monday, I talk with my best friend. Uh, on Tuesday afternoon, I play video games. On Wednesday morning, I go to the restaurant, and uh, on Thursday night, I um, play a movie with my family. On Friday night, uh, I go to the park with my pets, and Saturday, um, I work uh, with my partners in the university, and Sunday, uh, I visited, I put on, uh, on Sunday, I visit my grandma. Okay, okay, that's that was fantastic, Fatima. Excellent information. Luis Reyes, go ahead. Night. Perdón, teacher, una pregunta. Estas son las actividades que hacíamos nosotros. Yo me acabo de conectar. No. Yeah, Jessica, that's right. I mean, one uh, activity that you do on Monday, another one you do on Tuesday, on Wednesday, on Friday, on Saturday, and, and on Sunday. That's what we are sharing. An, an activity for every uh, day. Okay. Okay, Luis. Okay, uh, on Monday, uh, work like uh, on Tuesday, uh, after no footage court. On Wednesday, uh, reality store event. Uh, on Tuesday, night, be in class. Uh, on Friday, like uh, play with me louder. Uh, on Saturday, uh, activity in the supermarket. On Sunday, uh, 
They to go church. Okay, thank you, Luis. Hey, Luis. Yeah, let's remember that we need a subject, right? So if you say, I go to church, I go to the supermarket, I go shopping, okay, but you need to pronounce the, the subject, right? I, if you're I, talking about another person, then you say she or he, or it all depends on the info that you are providing. Okay, Luis. Okay, okay. Okay, now Wendy already participated, Luis already participated, Jennifer already participated. Fatima also. Julio Cesar. Okay, Julio. Go ahead with the information, please. Julio. Julio Cesar, are you there? Well, let's continue with Carlos Josue. Carlos Josue. Hello, Carlos. Ah, se me borró. Que lo había escrito aquí en el grupo. Pero, um, Monday, eh, I go to the cinema. Thursday, eh, I play basketball. On Wednesday, I eat pizza. I Thursday and I watch movie and Saturday and on Friday on Friday and I meet it visit I meet it with my family uh, on Saturday and I listen to music um, on Sunday and relax at home. Es que lo había escrito, pero se me borró porque lo, lo tenía en el chat. Ok, claro. Por no enviarlo. Ok, eh, más but, o menos. Yeah, I mean, uh, that, that was a, a great tip. For, that was a great uh, presentation. Thank you. Bueno, thank you. You're Ellen Nilsson. Okay. Uh, on Monday morning, I go to the work. On Tuesday night, I work in my restaurant. On Wednesday morning, I go to the room. On Thursday afternoon, I visit my father. On Friday night, I go to the gym. On Saturday, on Saturday night, I go to, go to the party. On Sunday afternoon, go to the beach. Okay, thank you very much. That's really nice. Okay, let's listen thank to you. lady. Okay, ladies. Okay. On Monday, I I go to the work. On um, Thursday. On Tuesday. Um, I watch movie. On Wednesday, I go to the gym. On Thursday, um, I visit my friends. Uh, on Friday, um, I listen music. On Saturday, I go to the church as a family. On Sundays, I visit my parents. That's all. Okay, thank you, ladies. Now let's listen to William. Hello, William.
Well, let us let us listen to uh, Jessica then. Jessica Noemi. Teacher, yo tenía eh, problemas para, para conectarme, por eso no escuché qué es lo que íbamos a hacer en ese momento. Pero le preguntaba hace un momento y no entendí lo que me dijo. Ah, ok. Now, the, la, la actividad es decir um, um, qué es lo que usted hace durante la semana. O sea, una, una actividad en específico el día lunes, una el martes, una el ah. miércoles, una el jueves, y así sucesivamente hasta el domingo. Okay, but ah, don't okay. don't worry, Jessica, because we're gonna continue uh, working with with the same topic. Let me see, Jennifer. Jennifer ya participó. Jennifer Rivas. O todavía hace falta. Yeah, Jennifer Rivas. Hi, teacher. Eh, no me no me había podido conectar. Así que hasta ahorita les estoy haciendo las oraciones. No sé si puedo participar después. Yeah, okay, you can do so. Okay, well, I I think uh, we have we have practice about person simple in first person. I I go to the gym. I lift weight. I, I go shopping. I clean the house. Uh, well, you mentioned a lot of activities, right? By using first person singular. Now let us let us work a little bit in in the book. This is what we started uh, yesterday, right? Creating we creating uh, questions with simple present. Uh, we we started about the auxiliary do and also about the auxiliary does, right? Does. We also noticed about the verb, okay? When you do or when you create a question. We also studied about answering yes or no with third person singular. That, uh, does she ask for assistance? Yes, yeah, she does or no, she doesn't. You have two options, right? Does he drive the truck on, on weekends? Yes, yeah, he does or no, he doesn't. Does Selena make phone calls? Yes, yeah, she does or no, she doesn't. Does our company check the police, the policy, sorry? Yes, yeah, it does or no, it does. So we were working with this, right? So what would be, for example, the, the question for the, for the following answer? Yes, it does. He fixes the AC on Friday. This is the air conditioner, right? So what is the question over here? ¿Cómo, cómo creamos una, una pregunta para esta respuesta? ¿Quién me ayuda? Yes, it does. He fixes the AC on Friday. Auxiliary does, for right? Example, for example, uh, Carlos fixes the AC on Friday. Okay, Car Carlos. Carlos fixes the AC on Friday. Yeah, but what would be the question? ¿Cómo podemos crear la pregunta? Do. Carlos, do you fix? No, but listen carefully. Fíjense bien. Uh, we but, have but, but. third person singular, right? No, oh, okay, uh-huh. Yeah. Uh, yes, it does. He fixes the AC on Friday. So, fíjense en, en, en esto para crear la... Does, yeah, para does crear his, la his, oración. Ok, ahora sí. Does he... Does fixes... Does, does he... Fixes? He fixes 
Ahora, ¿está de... bien fixes the AC on Friday? Fix. Fix. Fix, nada más. Ah, ok, it's only fix, right? Because we're using the auxiliary. Recuérdense yes. que cuando ocupamos do or does, el verbo siempre va a quedar de su, de, sí. de, en su forma base. Does it fix the AC on Friday? Okay, that's the first. Now, what about the second one, people? Yes, yeah, she does. She sends many emails to the customers. Does she send any emails? Does she send commerce? Does. Does. Okay, for the people who are still looking for this exercise, this exercise is on page 26. 26. 26. Okay, you said does. Does what? She. Does she? Send. Send. Many. Many emails. Many emails. Email. To customers. Okay, that's the second one. Does she send any emails to customers? Okay. Now, number three. No, she doesn't. She cleans the, the first floor only. Does she clean? Does she clean? The first floor. No, but it may be a different, right? Does she clean? It may be the second. The first. The second. The second. The second floor. Does she clean the second floor? No, she doesn't. She cleans the first floor mm -hmm. only. Oh, oh, mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> and the number four, people. Yes, it does. Eddie keeps track on the cells. Uh huh. Does does Eric does Eric very good? Hey, what about keep, the rest? Keep keep dropping the cell. Eric keep. Track on the sales. On the sales. And that's it, right? Okay. So this is about the uh, just no question thing and person simple things, uh, but specifically regarding to third person singular. Very good, Fatima. I can I can read what you typed in the in the chat. All right. So any questions so far? I pregunta hasta el momento. Hello, Fatima. Hello, Fatima. Yes, no. No question. No questions. All right. So uh, teacher, uh, yo ya tengo las oraciones, las oraciones. No sé si puedo compartirlas. Yes, Jennifer. Yes, you can share the synthesis. Okay. Uh, 
Monday I visited my grandmother. Um, a Tuesday, um, <clears throat> share with my friends. A Tuesday, uh, I go to drink. Thursday, um, go a class the bike. A Friday, I I go to watch <laughs> soccer game. Is the park. Um, Saturday visited my parents. Is Sunday uh, a share with my what friend? Okay, thank you, Jennifer. Remember that when we talk about specific day, day, sorry, they say on Monday, on Tuesday, on Wednesday, on uh thursday on friday on saturday on sunday but that was really good thank you jennifer now what well, about the other person I, I i remember there's a person that that's missing yet well otherwise otherwise we're going to continue with with the class well uh I have it is it is uh, well you can you can work in this activity later because I looked for a for a file and I, I let me see I look I look for a, a, an exercise so that we can solve it as a group and something that I want you to notice about the verb have is that you conjugate it like this. Look at the chat, please. I have. Okay, that is the very have, people. I have. You. I have. Yeah, look at the chat, please. You have. But when you move you to have. third person singular, he has. She has. It has, we have, you have, and they have, right? So this is the, the verb have. Okay, I have, you have, he has, she has, it has, we have, you have, and they have. That's the way we conjugate the verb to, to have. Okay, what am I telling you this? Because we're gonna see it in a minute in an exercise. Just give me one second, please. Okay, this is the one, no. Do me the favor. To open the file about the exercise I shared in, in WhatsApp, people. Well, I have it here. I will share it with you. Okay, now can you see the, the, the information? Can you see it, people?
Wendy, can you see the information? Can you see the document? Yes. Yeah, all right. So we're gonna work in this part, okay? But, uh, well, I think it's very if we do it in couples. Okay, yeah, we're gonna spend like, yeah, we're gonna spend like 20, 20 minutes with it. Vamos a ocupar um, 20 minutitos en, en pareja, okay? En pareja para, sol, para resolver este ejercicio. Ya todos lo tienen. ¿Qué es lo que van a hacer al inicio? Al inicio hay que ir poniendo lo, los verbos que se nos dan en paréntesis en su forma presente. Daily routine for symptoms family. Ok. We have the verb to be. We have the verb to have. We have the verb to work. Want. Oh. Is the other one study uh, to be married to be again to have etc. Right, so you have a lot of verbs over here. Aquí tienen muchos verbos para trabajar. Después que terminen eso de completarlo, um, aquí hay más todavía. Ok, van a trabajar en, la siguiente, en las siguientes indicaciones. En la segunda, van a subrayar toda, todas aquellas estructuras de presente simple. Todas las estructuras de presente simple. O le cambian color. Bueno, ahí ustedes, ustedes pues lo, lo van a indicar cuando les toque presentar. Now, number three. ¿Qué van a hacer en la tercera parte? En el cuadro que está acá, ¿ok? Eh, colocar los verbos. ¿Cómo, ¿Cómo se escriben en tercera persona? Si solo le agregan una S, pues le ponen ahí. Si le agregan ES, también lo ponen. Y pues por aquí faltaría, porque no sé si hay, hay verbos que terminan en I, griega. Bueno, igual, pero... Eh, por aquí los lo, lo van poniendo en categorías. Esa sería la otra parte. En el número 4, number 4, ustedes van a encontrar oraciones positivas. Las tienen que colocar en negativo para resolver el ejercicio. Ok, en and, and finally, y para cerrar, ustedes van a encontrar, van a buscar acá posibles errores que tiene la lectura y los van a corregir. Por ejemplo, les acab acabamos de ver el verbo have. ¿Se conjuga así el verbo have? Sarah has. No. 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 ¿Cuál es el problema ahí? Has. Ah, el verbo no se conjuga así. Entonces ahí ustedes le hacen los cambios. ¿De acuerdo? ¿Cuánto tiempo vamos a invertir? Vamos a, vamos a tratar de invertir 20 minutos 100% conectados acá. Ah, lo que vamos a hacer al final es que ustedes van a crear un... Bueno, aquí van, van a hacer su... Van a, van a colocar de, ya de manera correcta el, el párrafo. ¿Ok? Ah, estén preparados con la lectura porque también nos van a ayudar a leer... Eh, y a pronunciar de manera correcta la historia de, de esta familia. Ok. Now, ¿todos tienen listo ya el documento? Sí, yo sí, lo que estamos con el teléfono. Tell me, tell me. Pues, okay. eh, este archivo que nos mandó, eso que, que, que vamos a hacer es un archivo de PDF y creo, tengo entendido que un archivo de PDF no se puede eh, como escribir en sí. ese. Eh, sí es editable. Sí es editable, pero si tiene dificultades no. con el PDF, eh, por ahí también les coloqué el documento Word. Uh -huh. Ok. Para okay, que... Ok. Now, Carlos, do you have any question? 
sí que este con el con teléfono cuesta un poquito más y que creo que variamos un poquito más de tiempo. Ok, ok, pero eh, le recomiendo que 100% concentrado. Eh, si gusta, puede tener un, un cuadernito así a la par para ir poniendo, digamos, este, las respuestas aparte. Y este, ya cuando le toque presentar, pues ya solo nos va diciendo cómo van quedando las oraciones. Ok, Carlos. Ok, now we're going to okay. work in pairs. Vamos a trabajar en, en parejas. Quiero ver. Ahí se ayudan entre todos. Okay, here we go. Okay, yeah. I see. Yeah. I have the document. Okay, Sarah is, Sarah, Sarah is. Sarah is 26 years old. Well, Con el, con el plumoncito es que se escribe, ¿verdad? Eh, creo, sí, ¿Qué? creo que sí. Eh, sorry to interrupt, people. ¿Pueden compartir el documento para que los, los, los dos estén visualizando lo mismo? Ah, ok. Ok. ¿Pueden compartirlo? No. Ya lo corregiste. No. Ahorita esto yo lo quiero compartir la con no me sale eso, pero bueno. En, en el WhatsApp lo compartió el teacher y sí, lo compartió ahí. en el PDF y en ahí el otro. Okay. En no, Word. lo que pasa es que se me... Ahí está, ya, ya, ya lo entendí. Okay. Is, is 26. Ajá. 
Ajá, el tener es así. Sí. Sara tiene... Pero como dijo que le vamos a poner de esos cositos que están ahí adentro, de, en el paréntesis. Sa sería Sara is. Ah. Sara is 20, 20, uh, I'm sorry 60. to interrupt. Siento interrumpir. Pueden ¿Sí? compartir el documento para que las dos visualicen el, 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 el documento y puedan trabajar las juntas de mejor manera. Ah. ¿Cómo, ¿Cómo lo compartimos? Eh, ahí abajito hay una hay, hay un cuadrito con una flechita hacia arriba que dice compartir pantalla. Ah, ya, 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 ya. ya, ya. Okay, ah. Vamos, a ver, vamos a ver. No me da. A mí sí, ah, pero... ya, 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 ya. Ya no, lo vi. Pero... Ya, a ver. Compartir archivo, dice. Compartir imagen. Imagen, que es lo que tiene que decir, ¿verdad? ¿Será documento? Compart a mí me sale como compartir archivo. Sí, eh, configuración. Mire, sí. No sé. Usted no lo puede ver, ¿verdad? No. Eh, ahorita no, quiero ver si lo puedo compartir como documento, imágenes, audio, documento, no sé si estará en Drive, pero... Mira. Quiero ver, pero yo le di zoom, vamos a ver qué aparece. Bien chivo, Fabi. Aquí está. Aquí está. ¿Le aparece algo? No. No, ¿Usted lo ve? Yo sí lo veo. Sí, igual yo. Yo sí lo veo, usted lo ve. Yo lo compartí, sí. pero no sé qué se hizo. <risa> yo ahorita lo veo. Sería Simba. Sara Is. Ajá. All. Espera, espera. Ah, ok. Hola, Fátima. Sí, le escucho. Ah, sí, sí, hoy sí le escucho. Okay. Hoy sí. Sí, le habré conseguido con mi hermano un par de, de, de audífonos. Pero... Entonces, ah, ya pues. Este, sí, este estaba, de este cuadrito estaba, estaba consultándole de la like, have, you have, he has. Ah, está este bien. A, a utilizar, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Entonces, sí, vamos a complementar donde está. Eh, aparecen las rayitas del verbo to be no. según si es él, ella uh -huh. nosotros y así uh, sorry to interrupt ladies uh, you pueden compartir el documento Uh -huh. es para que puedan visualizar la, ambas. Por ejemplo, ahorita estoy, estoy compartiendo el documento. Ustedes tienen la opción de compartirlo uh -huh. también. Ok. Uh -huh. Sí, eh, Fátima tiene computador, entonces con ella lo... Ok. Lo... Ok. Thank you, teacher. Logra visualizar. Quiero ver. Sí. Ok. Entonces, estaba viendo también. 
Y ya poco está. para reforzar eh, el, el, la primera sería Va. con sería Va. con el, el grupo to be, ajá. pero sería Sara eh, como es ella sería Sara sí. Haas no como este es, 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 es ajá, cuando se hablan de una, de una eh, persona y es como uh -huh. el verbo to be, es siempre es el she is, o el I am, o el... Uh -huh. eh, entonces sí sería yeah. con, con esa. ¿verdad? Ahora, uh -huh. donde dice to have, entonces ahí sí vamos a utilizar este. Uh -huh. Ya, yeah. es sí, sí. Ahí sería she has. Sara is transición. Sí. Sí, es cierto, perdón, perdón, perdón. Sí, hello, hello everyone. I'm sorry, to hello, teacher. Eh, recuerden teacher. que tienen la opción de compartir pantalla, así se les va a hacer más fácil interactuar. Por lo menos yo ahorita estoy compartiendo el, el, los ejercicios. ¿Lo logran visualizar? Sí. Va, entonces, uno de ustedes puede compartirlo y trabajar ¿Cómo lo hago? en pareja. ¿Cómo lo hago? Va, voy a dejar de compartir yo ahorita. Abajo de la pantalla Ajá. está un cuadrito verde que dice compartir pantalla. ¿Ya lo visualizaron? En su pantalla. No, a ustedes les tiene que aparecer ah, también. Ah, ok, ok, ok. Va, ahí usted contenido. le da clic ahí y, y ahí pues este... Con pantalla. Ahí le va, le va a aparecer este, que, que comparta su pantalla. Va, y le da clic al, 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 a la imagen que usted quiera compartir, ¿ok? Comenzar a transmitir, dice. No, eh, 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 tiene que ser este... A mí, a mí no me deja... <ríe> No me sale. Teacher. A mí tampoco. Next. Teacher. <laughs> Teacher. Hello, hello, Carlos. Una pregunta. Eh, como estamos hablando de tercera persona, de Sara, sería has. Exactly, has. Ajá, ¿Verdad sí. que el verbo to be sería has? No. El verbo to be se, 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 se conjuga is. I am, you are, he is, she is, it is, we are, you are, and they are. Entonces, Entonces en el verbo se... have sí cambia. I have, you have, he has. Ok, ok. Ya, 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 sí, 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 right. no, no. Entonces la primera sería Sara is 26 years old. She is tall and thin. She has uh, blonde and hairy and gray years. Age. She works. Porque se le agrega S, ¿verdad? Porque es tercera persona. Exactly, exactly. So ¿verdad? here will be. La, la, en las dos primeras me había equivocado. Sarah is 26. Mm -hmm. Sarah is 26 years old. Okay. She, okay, she. Yeah. Uh -huh. Sí, ya, 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 ya entendí, ya entendí. Ok, muy bien. Thank you. Vaya, entonces. Sara is. Ahorita vamos por la por la sexta o la quinta, quiero ver. Tienes que modificarlo. Porque no me equivoqué. De verdad. ¿En mm. cuál? Espérame, te voy, te voy a compartir el voz y te lo puedo compartir yo. Pantalla. So. A mí no me dejó compartir. ¿Y ahora cómo te sale? Lo mismo. Eh... Va, esperame, esperame. Espérame, ahorita Espérame, ahora, ahí está, ahí está, ahí sí, ahí sí aparece. Vaya, entonces en la primera sería 
has. No, he is. Sería is. is. Ajá. ¿Cómo? ¿Cómo, cómo se escribe? <ríe> ahorita. Dale ahorita, espera. <ríe> Qué difícil el teléfono. No, Estoy... y... Sería is. Is, así nada más. Is. The ah, second bueno, pero... sería is también. Come is. Is. En el segundo también. Sí. Is. Sara is, she is. Así, ¿verdad? Um, sí. Quiero ver, 76, eh, 26. Vale, ahí está. En el entonces, otro, Shay, Shay, Lo otro también. Entonces, eh, tam, aquí estamos en Become Teacher of French, French and English. Después, She Studies. Vamos a poner está es está teacher tell me tell me sería estudies o estudies estudies studies sería y llega ese va no 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 ah uh ah -uh. the way you did it así como lo había escrito ¿Verdad que así como lo había escrito? Yeah, Ajá. exactly. Ok. Vale. Thank you. Entonces, en ya, esta ya serie... Me ya, ya me chivolé, Carlos. Vaya. Me... Eh, en la primera... Vaya, aquí, que me... has, de ahí iría work. No, no mira. Ahí, ahí lo estoy compartiendo. Te voy a explicar. Cuando estás hablando de, de tercera persona, estamos hablando de she, he, They have también, ¿verdad? Sí. They have a small house with two bedrooms on one room, two bedrooms on teacher in a garage. They Plan. <clears throat> they plan to move to England next year. Yeah. They plan. Plan. They plan. Será que no va a ir en eso. No. Es que eso es lo que estaba preguntando. Si no va a ir. Yo creo que sí, porque tienen que estructurar, ¿no? Pero estoy viendo que hay mejor acciones. Yo la quiero ver. Pues como estamos en presente simple, uh -huh. entonces no lleva el de A. también verdad Ajá, bueno porque, entonces sería... porque por bueno cuando estamos viendo un ejemplo solo dice they help company no dice they are help people mm, they they plan to move to England next year Bueno, entonces quedamos en. Me quedé yo en plan, ¿verdad? De... Ajá. De plan. Uh -huh. O sería. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco, seis. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco, seis. 
Esposo, le dice esposo. Pero si sería esposo, sería Sara. Uh -huh. Sería husband. Sara and her husband, Tom. Pero quiero ver el contexto mejor. Sara. Twenty eight years old. Sí. El. No, mi amor. Sara. Tiene. Don Gijas sería Don. Sería entonces eh... pero quiero ver, fíjese que tu vi María será esta casada con Tom pero no dice Sara. Quiere casarse con Tom, ¿no? No. Sara is married to Tom. Ah, pues sí. Porque... Ajá, Sara está casada con Tom, es Sara no. is married to Tom. ¿Cómo, cómo me dijo? Sara is uh -huh. married to Tom. Ajá, Tom está casada con Tom. Ajá, y luego dice. Y tiene, y esto sería, he has. Uh, en la siguiente, donde, donde termina Tom, ¿verdad? Él tiene. Ajá, él tiene. Él... Uh -huh. 28 years old. Leyer with a passion for traveling. Él le apasiona viajar, dice. Together day. Sí, mi amor, me falta un poquito. Él tiene, él es, él, él, has, ¿verdad? Sí. Mi amor. ¿No te quieres acostar aquí? Aquí, mira. No, aquí voy a estar pendiente de que no venga ni una cuca. Aquí, acústate. Aquí voy a estar yo. Quería... Quiero ver, me, me perdí. ¿Dónde? Tra viajar, traveling. Together. Juntos. Junto a ellos, junto a ellos, no junto a ellos, no. Okay. Sería como, ajá, les le pusieron a trabajar juntos. Junto. Tu hub. Tu chile. Junto a ellos. No, hombre, todavía son 20 minutos que tengo que estar así, Steven. 
Yo cuando te dije de hoy que estaba Mamá, ocupado, no, te dije así, lo, no, lo podí, no los podía hacer porque se iban a ser feos. Entonces, prepáralos. Solo calentar las tortillitas así en la cacerola y calentar el boladito que está ahí, en el, que está el, la carne. Y luego los pones. No, ese no lleva tomate porque lleva quesillo. De ellos. Dice, dice. Children. Junto, junto a sus hijos sería. Eh, eso quiero ver. The children. A las niñas. Children son niñas, pero creo que to, to have to children. Pero es que have no es como de tener. To children. Sí. To quedar de. Y tu quedar de como junto, ¿verdad? No, no, ajá. Juntos. No, dice viajar a. El, dice. Pero es que dice Tom el un abogado de 20 años de edad con una pasión para viajar al extranjero juntos a sus a sus niños the girls, the girls with. Mm -hmm. juntos juntos a sus niños gemelos no juntos pero es que está juntos ya está juntos a sus children niños Juntas, es que no entiendo, ahí me he perdido. Ay, espérame, espérame. Ay, que esto sí que. Maya, ven. Ah, pero ver, quiero ver. The children. Hello, Ellen Nilsson. Hello, Wendy. Did you finish? Yeah. No, I did Okay. Do you need she... some more time? She likes. Sería con la S al final. Yes, she likes. She usually she wears. Wears in the S. Oh, no. She usually. Dice, she usually. She dice wear. Wear. Con S. Hola, S. Lleva S al final, wear. Sí. Sí, hola. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. A white blues with jeans or white shirts with black pants. Meanwhile, Tom. White on wake up. Wake up. Wait. The twins and help. Para para tener. Eh, dice para para no ellos eh, ellos bien ah, porque cabal así era mire juntos tienen dos hijos que son este Maya y Vin el uh -huh. el auto y el perro 
they to live, que viven. No, ellos viven sería, ¿verdad? Ellos viven en la isla de Rumania. Ellos, ellos, ellos viven. Ellos, dice ellos, ellos. They live. Sería, they live. They, ay, no. No, Qué hija. pena. On and live, tiene que ser, ¿verdad? On and live, live. Ajá. On and live. Live, live. Ya no me saco. Uh, de ahí dice... Sí. Ajá. Ellos tienen una pequeña casa. Ajá. On in Libby, ¿verdad? Ajá. De vale. how. De... How. 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 Vale. how. A small house. One. Hello, everyone. Hello, hello. Sí, 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 por el sonido. Hello, hello, hello. <laughs> okay, Luis, how, how was the activity? Difficult, easy. <laughs> Can Divertido y, y extrovertido. <laughs> Estuvo esta dinámica ahorita, la verdad. Oh, oh, okay. <laughs> so don't worry because, well, tonight and tomorrow night, we will continue working in something similar right it's because you know simple present uh, the more we practice the more we learn okay so that's that is the key right so well we're gonna read it uh, we're gonna try to do it only orally because we, we don't have enough time okay and uh, for example i have the information about sarah right daily routine for a simpsons family Okay, who starts? Quem me da leer? Así como lo trabajaron. Well, I will ask then somebody to help me. Uh, Jennifer, please, could you could you please read the sentence? Sarah is tell and time. She is tall and, and thin. Okay, and, okay, the first one is Sarah is 26 years old. Yep. Yes. Yeah, the second one? She is. She is. Tall and thin. And, and she. And thin. She. She. Per, eh, per me, she. She has blonde hair. Um, hair. Hair. Okay. Hair. Here. And green eyes. Green eyes. All right. She. She works. 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 Excellent. She works as waitress. As a waitress. A restaurant. By. In restaurant. Bye. She wants. She works. Permítame. Wants. She studies. But she wants. Want. Restaurant. Want she wants. Restaurant. But what she wants. She wants. Good. To become a teacher of um, of um, I. England, in England, she Oops. studies. Yes. Studies. Yes. Her everyday Sara is married. Is married to Tom. He has. Yes. Sorry, sorry. I'm sorry. Yes. 
Yes. Is that on back to one? To Tom, he is at at twenty eight years old. Lawyer with a passion for traveling abroad. 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 Oh, oh, okay. okay. Thank you very much. Thank you, uh, Jennifer. Okay. okay. Thank you very much. Let's continue with um, Carlos Josué. Coach Together Jennifer. they have to shield their dream. Maya and Bell and Kat and Dad, they live. Is live or lives? They live. Okay. In IS Romania, they have a small house with two. The ro the room. On limb row to bathroom on kitchen and garage. They plan to move England next year to receive better job there in the to they fly Sarah website at half past six in the morning she she stretched she goes to bathroom. She washes her face, brush her teeth, and do hair, then gets for work she likes. She likes to wear pretty clothing. She using wears and blue or pink dress. I white, blue witch, jean or jeans shirt with band pants. Me will Tom wakes up the twin and helps to the re get ready for school as they finish it. Sarah goes into kitchen and prepares breakfast. Sometimes when she is, she is in the hungry, he gives to, he gives the meal and cereal, but usually she make the sandwich with cheese, cold meat, salami, ham, salt, cucumber, tomatoes, and she always leave the something sweet on the table like a cookie or piece of homemade cake. Thank you. Thank, thank you very much. <laughs> okay, let's listen to Ellen Nilsson. Ah, en vez de estar jugando, era puesta a picar el, el tomate y, la, y, y el cilantro, pero como yo tengo que hacer todo, no, hombre, yo no. <laughs> Okay, Ellen Nilsson. Ah. Well, you will you will start by saying like, let me see. Do me the favor to continue in this part. Tom. Yeah. Tom. La segunda página no la hicimos con, con mi grupo. 
<ríe> ya no alcanzamos. Ahí es que eres. Don't wake, wake up. The twin and help them to get ready for school after she to finish it. Chara to go into the kitchen and to prepare. Oh, okay. Do the okay. Now in here is it? She she goes into the kitchen and she goes into the end. She to prepare. She prepares. 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 Very fast. Sometime. Sometime. When she. When she. When she is in a hurry. Is in the hurry. She. She gives. She gives them the meal. Okay, now let's stop it there. Vamos a detenernos acá. <clears throat> so, you know what, people, tomorrow eh, you will be in charge of eh, sharing what you did. Mañana van a compartir lo, ese documento, algunos de ustedes, y nos van a ir este, leyendo la información. ¿Cómo, cómo quedó? Por el momento. Ok, okay teacher, porque, okay. bueno, lo personal, eh, no, bueno, yo me quedé a medias. La verdad que con el teléfono es bien difícil. Este, pero mañana con más tiempo ah, lo voy a lo voy a lograr terminar y, y pues para representar el grupo que, que hicimos con, con Carlos. Oh, ok. Eh, no, sí, otra cosa, espero que es, ya hayan trabajado en el, en el midterm, en la evaluación de la semana. Eso está en la plataforma. Es, es necesario eh, que no se vayan a quedar sin esa evaluación, sin la nota de esa evaluación. Ok. Uh, vamos a hacer una cosa. Voy a pasar lista. Y si usted aún todavía no ha terminado con el ejercicio, puede hacerlo ahorita. Ok. Ok, Carlos Josué. Aquí el teacher. Good, Carlos. Eh, Denise. Edgardo Daniel, Edwin Osvaldo, Ellen Nilsson, Esperanza, Evelyn Yanira, Fátima Michel. Aquí, presente. Gabriela Jazmín. Henry Giovanni. Sí. Jennifer Guadalupe. Present teacher. Ok. Juan Carlos Beltrán. 
Julio César. Carla María. Hey, I don't know what happened to Carla. Ladies. Present teacher. Okay. Luis José. Obed. Wendy Carolina. William Aristides. Madali. Here. Okay, Madali. Jessica Noemi. Present teacher. Okay, so that's it. That's fantastic. We are done with it. ¿Qué pasó? Teacher, tengo una pregunta. Tell me. El, 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 miren, miren, solo es, trae cuatro partes o cuántas. Sí, cuatro. A las cuatro de contestar o, o solo. Yeah, I think they are, they are four. Permítame, lo vamos a. Uh -huh, por favor. Lo vamos a compartir. Se permiten de parte dos, ¿verdad? Donde el suma. Seis pies en el juego. Ah, pero solo seis nada más. Yo quiero una michelada. Okay, this is a mid term, right? Es Eva. Yeah. Cuatro, entonces. Part one, yeah, four parts. Okay, va a ser lo que estaba de ella lo terminé. Part two. Okay. Part three. And part four. And this is the last one, right? Okay. Thank you for information. Okay, yeah, that 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 was part number four. Well, I don't know if there is any other question. I will share what I have here. Okay, now I will check. This is this is something that we we need to go over to tonight or tomorrow. Well, we still have like like some some minutes over here. Now we, we have talked about daily routine, right? And I also told you that we are in charge of uh, sharing the album about the professions and occupations, okay? But before going to that part, uh, let, us, let us try to, um, to get information about the, the, the professions that are over here. 
software engineer, human uh, resource specialist, financial analyst, insurance uh, agent, bookkeeper, digital marketing manager. Do you remember about what they do? ¿Se recuerdan la, las actividades que ellos hacen? A software manager, or a software engineer, Tell me, what does that person do? Installing software. Okay, you, you, can, you can look for information in the internet, okay? Software engineer. What does a software engineer do? Sign and... No sé cómo se pronuncia. Develop. Develop. Ajá. Different software. Ok. That's uh, what a software engineer uh, does. What about a human resource specialist? Eh, especialista de recursos humanos. Yeah, but what does what the does person do? Now the the leases and regulations. Um, in in Barba, in the. Ay, la palabra no puedo pronunciar, pero es como okay. gestión. <laughs> Mana. He manages. He manages. Yeah. He manages human resources. Employees. Or the employees. Okay. What about a financial analyst? Analyst financial. What does that person do? Tell people and business manager. Okay, help people to manage their finance. What about insurance agent? Help people and companies gain financial loss and manage risks. Okay, what about a bookkeeper? Keep track of the financial account of company. Digital marketing manager. Create and advertise the company of the successful manager. Okay, thank you very much. Now, well, over here, you, okay. you can ask uh, different partners, okay? Uh, people who are in the class or people who are not in the class about what's their occupation, okay? So if you know somebody who uh, works as a software engineer, write down his name over here and tell us about uh, the activities he or she does. Uh, well, something that we studied tonight is also about the days of the week. Do you remember about the days of the week? We are on a page 27, in page 27. Days of the week, what is the first day of the week, people? Monday. Monday, good. Capital letter, Monday. What is the second day? Tuesday. Tuesday. First day. Tuesday. Where is the third day of the week? Wednesday. Wednesday. What about fourth day of the week? Thursday. 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 
fifth day friday friday next day saturday saturday and just to finish no fue, sunday. sunday sunday remember days of the week months of the year are typed or are written down by using capital letter capital letter okay so um I don't know if you have any questions about it. No questions, teacher. No questions. Okay, very so, clear. Very clear. So, wh where's going to be your task for for to for tonight and for tomorrow? You need to complete the exercise. Okay, the file that I share with you about the Simpson family. Tienen que completar para el día de mañana el, los ejercicios que comenzamos ahora. Mañana los vamos a revisar, ¿ok? Algunos de ustedes van a compartir pantalla para, para irnos indicando cómo es que resolvieron esos ejercicios. All right? So, eh, let me see. Well, I have already checked the list of tiendas. Ya revisé, ya chequeé la, la asistencia. Eh, I don't know if you have any comment or a, any... Um, Question, it would be really nice. We still have one minute. La no tarea sería teacher, um, la de la página. Complete the page. 27. 27. Yeah, 27 is one of them, right? Uh, but, see. Okay. Y los ejercicios que comenzamos ahora de la familia no, Simpson. El PDF. El PDF. Ah, okay. ok. Aparte de eso, y recuérdense que ustedes tienen ya hace algún par de días, ya hicieron su álbum de este, las profesiones y ocupaciones. Mañana sí, yo pensaba pues invertir un, unos minutos esta noche en eso, pero ya no nos alcanzó el tiempo. Entonces, mañana sí lo vamos a hacer, ¿ok? Listos con el álbum de ocupaciones y profesiones, ¿ok? Ok, so let's see tomorrow, people. It's been a pleasure for me to be here again. Do me the favor to get connected tomorrow night. See you tomorrow. Bye. See you tomorrow. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night.